the good parts of the fight were that I really started believing in myself and my strikes and, and I, I followed when my coaches wanted me to do till the third round. <laughs> but you know, I mean, better get caught when you're trying to be too aggressive and finish a fight right than just, you know, playing easy. I don't know which kick dropped her because I dropped her twice, right? In the third round, I, I hit her with, yeah, with my, my right leg kick. You know, hats off, credit to Caitlin Young for that because that's what she knocked Misha out with in their fight in 2000. Seven or whenever it was, and hats off to her. You know, Caitlin's one of my heroes, and I hoped I did credit to her. Unfortunately, she finished hers with her kick. Should have gone back and done it again. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> um, that was me being stupid. Like, there's no explanation for that. I should have gotten back to my feet and done exactly what I'd been doing and what was winning me the fight. I just really wanted to knock her out. I just, I got too enthusiastic, too happy about it. And I'm, I'm sad right now, but at the same time, my favorite part of fighting is fighting, and I got to do that tonight, finally, for the first time in a year. So. You know, I want to be a winner, but I think that I, I get to be a winner when I get to play. Yeah. In the second round, when I, I don't know if it was a jab or a hook, but something popped in my shoulder, my left shoulder, and I was trying to keep my hands up, but um, it's kind of why I was like more like, oh, I better keep kicking and stuff like that. And that's, I think, how she secured the takedowns, or what, what happened with the reversal in the second round, where it was all about, oh, now i got to get off my back. Because, um, and, you know, and then I was on my back. <laughs> she was on my back. But, um, yeah, it... Uh, Something, something's going on with my shoulder. We're going to go have a doctor look at it because I'm, I'm, I'm hurting. I'm hurting. <laughs> uh, um, how much did that affect the, her, her eventual arm bar finish? Um, I don't want to blame losing on that, but I, it was very, very hard to stack from where I was at. Every time I put pressure forward, you know, I'll consult with my coaches. We'll find an alternate way to, to stack than using shoulder pressure, but it was just absolutely, it was like, I felt like something was driving driving into my neck and my shoulder, like like driving into me, so something's going on in there. <laughs> yeah. Yes, besides the lack of submission defense. <laughs> yes, this is the Julie Kedzie that's always been there and the Julie Kedzie that loves to fight. And, I, you know, I lost today, but I love my job. I love being a professional fighter, and I hope that even though it's two losses in a row, Strike Force recognizes that and they continue to, to help my career. And last thing, Dana White tweeted, I now know who Julie Kedzie is. Ah! Thank you, sir. Thank you, Dana. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> I appreciate that. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> well, you know, there's so many fighters out there, but there's not as many. You know, he doesn't know the girls yet, so. Hi! <laughs> What's up, sir? <laughs>